Elvis's youngest impersonator will travel to Tennessee to perform in a special tribute, which is tonight. And uh, they're naming Elvis Presley Tribute Week in Honolulu and Hawaii from now on in conjunction with your Elvis Tribute Week here in Tennessee. two copies of this proclamation, one that uh, Bruno would like to present to Mr. Jack Soden and the Elvis Presley estate, and the one that we would like to get uh, Jack and some of the other executors to sign, and we'd like to take it back and hang it in uh, Honolulu, where many people can see it there. You know, this is, uh, since Bruno started doing this Elvis impersonation, which is almost two years now, he started at the age of two. And uh, it's been non-stop ever since. Elvis, I mean, Bruno is really fascinated with the Elvis Presley legend. He watches all... A couple of weeks ago, Bruno was on the cover, and he was the centerfold for the Weekly World News. It's a supermarket tabloid, just like the Inquirer. And this psychic in Los Angeles had all of the evidence that concluded, without a doubt, that Bruno is the reincarnation of Elvis Presley. <laughs> It was really entertaining because he said things like the words to Elvis's songs just come to Bruno. Nobody ever has to teach him. Now, of course, we as his parents, we know differently because we help them with the words to the songs. He said things like in the middle of the night, Bruno sometimes calls out the name Priscilla. <laughs> hey, Bruno. I never did ask you, and I'm curious, uh, and I'm sure all these people would like to know, in the middle of the night, do you ever call out the name Priscilla? No, Daddy, you do. She is a beautiful woman. <laughs> no. Anyway, um, you know, Elvis always said it, anyway, in all of his books, that uh, his own personal favorite movie was King Creole, because it did give him a chance to demonstrate his uh, acting ability, his dramatic acting ability. And Bruno's favorite song comes from that movie, and he'd like to do that for you right now. He, although he's changed a couple of the words from the song so he can identify himself as Bruno. He knows he's not Elvis, he is four-year-old Bruno, but he definitely is the world's youngest Elvis impersonator. May I have some music, sir? Trouble, but I never 